about the first 20 years I'd have been just doing this all day on the bench, you know. So that was interesting work, different patterns. I start off just like chiselling it through to get rid of the metal. Yeah. And then I pull these dental burrs through, which rounds it up and cleans it up. Yeah. And I just keep going through to working down to the right depth. Uh, we've known each other for um, 1976. He knows exactly when he puts that bird in, he knows he's going to the same depth. This is what we're trained to do. People don't make things with their hands anymore. You know, that's why people like watching people do lock gates and glass blowing and forging and stuff like that because it's, it's something different than the norm. I remember when I first met Norman and Ian and um, they were talking about the handcrafted nature of what they do and the engraving and everything. It was something I really liked and, and wanted to embrace in one of the designs. So it was a case of just getting the right texture. Rough, rough line work. Bring out that sort of hand-drawn nature of the line work. And uh, that can be replicated really nicely in the uh, etching that Ian and Norman are gonna do. What I'm doing now, I've just fit the tool into the existing work and I'm going to run it down, round, put some pressure on and the pressure will clean, make this shiny, the bottom of the work shiny and that's where I'll let you away next time. <laughs> 